Welcome to the Southern Grill of Ellendale. This Sussex County restaurant is the only place in the state still serving this Delaware delicacy. Folks from all over the place, come and get that rat. Every Wednesday during muskrat season, the dining room fills with hearty fans looking to get their muskrat fix. Wednesday night, the phone's ringing. It's ringing all week long, muskrat, are you having muskrat? People pile in here and have good conversation and good muskrat. Experienced eaters like Milford's Chuck Coverdale order their muskrat with the heads on. I got two extra heads because basically a lot of people come in, they say we don't want the head on it. That's the best part of it right there. The jaws and the brain, that's the best part. And all you have to do to get the brain out of it. And there it is, right there. Right there, it's a little tiny, it looks like a little almond is what it looks like. <laughs> that's the brain. Mm. I may not be as brave as Chuck, but I gave it a shot. It's not bad. <laughs> Not bad. Others aren't so eager. They'll see the plate and say, what is that? Oh my God. They've never seen a muskrat before. I can't go there. <laughs> I really can't. Rat is in the name. It's a musk rat. I must not eat it. The obvious question is, what does muskrat taste like? Well, it's a little difficult to describe. To begin with, it's all dark meat. Uh, some people have described it as stringy. Oh, of course, it's a little gamey. Okay, it's a little gamey, but you know, whatever you taste you have in your mind, that's what it's going to taste like. Everybody says it tastes like beef, but you know, that's what everybody says. It tastes like dry roast beef. I know that there are a lot of people who love it and swear by it and think it's it's great, but I'm not a muskrat. I don't have that muskrat love.